Hi everyone, I'm Kate from Nano Girl and I can't wait to hit the beach this summer. Next time you're at the beach, I've got an awesome science experiment that you can do because it's all about seawater. Now, I've got three glasses of water in front of me. This one is drinking water from the tap in my kitchen. I'm going to put this egg into the water and let's see what happens. It sinks straight to the bottom. Okay, now this one is super salty water. I put like five or six tablespoons of salt into this water. So let's not drink this one. And when I put another egg into this water, oh, what's gonna happen? It floats straight away. So the reason the egg floats in this salt water is because this salt water is more dense than my drinking water. Dense means that it has more stuff in it. So when I added more salt to it, that means that it can take the weight of the egg and that's what makes it float. Now this one is seawater from a beach near my house. And we know that seawater is salty and that's why it tastes disgusting if you ever have to drink it. Now, seawater is a little bit different from every beach around New Zealand. This is gonna be different every time we do it, but I'm gonna put another egg into this water and we're gonna see what happens. Ooh, so this is about halfway between the two. It's kind of floating, but not really. I think I can make the egg in this one float just by adding a little bit more salt. So here we go. I'm gonna start off with one spoonful of salt and give it a good stir. So just by stirring one spoonful of salt into my seawater, I got this egg to float. That means I increased the density of the seawater. Next time you're at the beach, grab yourself a bucket of seawater and investigate how salty the sea is where you are. Have an awesome summer. Bye.